Oh. So, good evening, man. I've heard that there is this, uh, I think, uh, a different kind of Starbucks called, uh, called uh, Starbucks Reserve. So, I'm not sure, man. I've never heard of this Starbucks Reserve. So, I'm going to try and see if it is really like a normal Starbucks or something out of the ordinary. So here it is, man. A little bit different kind of logo. It has a star and R. So very, very... So as you can see here, Starbucks. All right, man. Here we go, man. I think I'm going to try the pumpkin spice latte, man. Let's see, man. Let's see. Here I am, eh? I ordered this spicy pumpkin latte. Oh, it's a different kind of Starbucks, man. This one. Oh, oh so here it is, man. The uh, pumpkin spice latte from Starbucks Reserve. So, this is huge, man. The Starbucks here, it's really nice, cooling. No wonder it is called a reserve, man. Oh, so it's nice, man. It's nice for you to come and do your work. You want to write? You want to be a writer? This is the right place to come and get inspiration to be a writer, man. So let me try the Starbucks latte first, man, and see if it is good. The pumpkin spice latte tastes okay, man. For 22 ringgit, I think this is a one-off, man. But uh, you cannot beat the uh, ambience. Oh. So I finally came out from uh, Starbucks Reserve. My first time ever. I've never heard this Starbucks Reserve before. So you know what? Ah, the pumpkin latte tastes like, mm, like an, any ordinary Starbucks drink. So nothing to be proud of. It's just much more, probably much more expensive because it is a little bit more classy. More uh, prestigious, I guess, the setting. More bigger, I think. That's why they call it Reserve. Well, so if you're a really coffee lover, Maybe you will appreciate this a little bit more. But for the ambience, I think it is nice. If you want to write a book, it is perfect place, man. For a writer or for to study. Alright, so that's all for today. Have a nice day. Bye. Oh. Ooh.